When a follower of Jesus Christ dies, their soul immediately goes into heaven, into the presence of God, and there will be with God forever and ever. There's a lot that goes on after that, but that's basically the story. But when us, what about the guy who says, I ain't following Jesus? Jesus says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father but through me. So a person who says, I'm not following Jesus. I'm not going to receive Jesus' sacrifice on my account. That person goes to a place called hell. And whenever he faces God in judgment, Revelation chapter 20, verse 11 and following, when he faces God in judgment, he faces God on his own terms. He's judged according to his own works. He is not judged according to the works of Jesus like Christians are. He's judged according to his own works. And if he's got any sin in his life, I mean any sin in his life, Life, he will spend eternity in hell. The fact of the matter is every one of us have sin in our life, and if we don't have a Savior to put his blood upon us, we're going to hell. Jesus Christ is the only Savior. He's the only hope. And if you have not accepted him as your Lord and Savior, on that dreaded day when you stand before God, you are going to be judged according to your works. Think about your works a minute. It's not going to be like if your good works outweigh your bad works. It's going to be like, do you have any sin at all in your life? Ever told a lie? Ever commit adultery? Ever ever uh, cheat somebody? It doesn't matter. You're born with sin. And if you don't accept the blood sacrifice of Jesus Christ, you'll spend eternity in the lake of fire that burns forever and ever. Jesus is your hope. Give him your life and you'll be glad you did.